Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of cancer. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. So what I have here is uh, a wish and it is kind of sitting in a uh, suspension. Um, it, this is representing something that is desired, but this person doesn't know if they will get it or not. They don't know if they'll get their wish or not. Um, and so they're, they're sitting here thinking, um, maybe they've been sitting here for some time. Maybe they feel like they've, they're running out of time. Maybe they're feeling like they're losing hope, maybe even, um, for this direction that they desire to take. Or that's how they were feeling. Uh, but maybe they get some type of light bulb moment here. We see like they suddenly get an idea. You see how he's looking through these details in the book of what has been written and suddenly he sees something. Okay, so um, I feel like this person, um, I feel like you're going to hear from them. Okay, I feel like maybe they suddenly know or have an idea how they're going to get that wish or how to get that wish. I feel like at the root of this, I think that there they could be uh, worried uh, about not getting the wish, about getting their heart broken here, because I feel like they have broken your heart, you see. And so I feel like they had you but lost you. And this is them trying to figure out how to get you back. I feel like there was a, this is a consequence for a decision that they made in the past. And this is why they're sitting in this position. I feel like they made a mistake. They weren't careful. Okay. And, um, and now you're going to hear from this person. Uh, and I think they're going to be a little nervous. Uh, coming forward. Um, I feel like they're, they want to possibly make you an agreement or um, or um, new promise of some kind. I feel like this person wants to extend the olive branch with you uh, to you. I feel like they don't want this fight anymore. They don't want to be away from you anymore. And I feel like if there are changes that are needed, and I believe that there are, I, I believe that somebody may not have been uh, open to talking about them before, uh, but I feel like everything now is going to kind of like get laid on the table. So, uh, you know, um, you're going to learn something from this person. You're going to learn why this happened. Um, see they're hiding their heart they're hiding their feelings and so I feel like you're going to get clarity on this person's feelings and how they were feeling in the past I feel like there's something you weren't seeing um, because I feel there were communication issues uh, between the two of you this is where you're, you're going to need to, you're going to need to work on this in the future so change is coming to your situation and so this could lead to a change in status somebody is coming to see you here okay and you can see that they're worried because they're coming with the nine of swords okay um, there is something that is eating away at this person they could be um, this could be their fears this could be uh, guilt for uh, a mistake that they made for uh, having hurt you and now it's like the shoes on the other foot and uh, and they're afraid you're going to break their heart okay here they are on the outside looking in with a glimmer of hope this is uh, a card that speaks to a glimmer of hope and um, on this we have the convenenza and so um, the convenenza is about bearing one's soul. Um, telling you what's in their heart. Yeah. So, uh, and then we have that page of swords. So 
I feel like this is what's coming. Somebody is going to really open up to you with these two pages. You are going to learn something, and it's going to be a very intense moment, okay? Um, a lot of emotions, a very emotional uh, meeting that's coming. This is a meeting of some kind here. I, I feel like you will learn a lot um, about your person, um, things you, it's like at the end of this conversation, it feels like you know this person more than you ever did before, and you thought you knew them before, but you didn't. Um, I feel like now it's like they're ready, they're ready to talk. They made a mistake, and I feel like uh, I feel like they're sorry for that mistake. Um, I feel like this person is really uh, longing to talk to you. Um, this is a card of hope. Um, see, they weren't careful, but they are hoping to change things to change card down here. Um, this person is opening their mind, developing new views uh, on, uh, on everything, what happened between you, why. They have mixed feelings about whether or not you're going to take them back, whether or not you're going to believe them. Or not, you know. Um, they were hiding. This person was, they were very hard to read. Like, you would not have known. Uh, you may have felt something was wrong um, because you are very intuitive, but you would not have known uh, what it was because they don't open up. Um, and so this situation really is the consequence of somebody's action, of somebody uh, somebody did something impulsively, somebody did something without really thinking, um, somebody did something uh, based upon uh, on emotion. They were coming was coming from uh, an emotional place, okay. And and here's the thing. They would have never made that mistake had they been willing to open up about these emotions in the past. I feel like now they are ready to do this and that's what's really going to change the relationship. But you have to keep it going, keep it flowing, keep the, the communication uh, flowing between you two. So there, you're about to learn something. Um, there, you're going to hear from this person. Um, they have, they're worried. They have some mixed feelings about uh, how you're going to, um, how you're going to receive them and the information that they're bringing. I think you will ask a lot of questions, um, but, uh, but I think that from here. Um, I think you might be surprised by what they're going to tell you, but I think from here, whatever happens at this meeting, I think is going to really deepen your relationship with this Four of Wands and the Great Fortune card here. So the Great Fortune card uh, speaks to improvements. So this talk you're going to have is, is really going to uh, improve uh, the communication and the connection uh, between you two and allow I feel for this uh, a change in status to occur okay so I feel like you are going to reconcile and get back together but this great fortune card comes with a warning okay this is new opportunities um, this is a uh, it feels like a winning streak um, but it is short term Okay, it does speak to improvements in your current situation, but you still have to work at it is what it's saying. Okay, so keep the communication 
lines flowing between the two of you. Okay, that's going to be key uh, to uh, to keeping to keeping that great fortune to keeping that uh, that luck going. So something is about to be revealed to you. Um, this person has been longing to tell you this. That is what I have for you. I thank you for watching, for liking and for sharing my videos and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.